If you are new here, my name is Julie for 254 Nature Grass. I post videos on gardening, growing affordable food at home, and how you can save money. So hop in, subscribe, let's get in and enjoy the video! To know whether the water is moving, see, sometimes when you water like this and you do this, sometimes it doesn't even go that deep, you see, so if you just come water your plant and you just water the surface here and you don't repeat watering over and over again till the water seeps in, it means at the bottom here it's dry so that is what you have to solve so let's get working okay this is a good system especially if you are doing urban gardening i mean an urban area and if you have a nine to five and sometimes you are so caught up doing some other things so just make sure the bottle can go in like that there are many ways of doing it this is uh, this is one method i'll demonstrate another one again another time using a different plant so just make sure the bottle can go in next i'm going to make some tiny holes at the sides of the bottle because i want the water to go to this side and this side where the roots of the plants are going to be i'm not going to make a hole at the bottom for the water to go down i want the water to spread going this side and this side so make holes at the side of the bottle don't do it at the bottom so let me just make holes drill some holes through or use a nail whatever you have here i'm just going to use a nail it's so easy and make some holes fill it with water then i'm going to cover it back so when i have time to water all I have to do is just to fill this bottle and the soil is going to remain moist. Where the first hole is, look at this. It should be down here where the root starts, from down here. So this should be the level of the first hole. So this is the level of the first hole. See? And I'm going to you're going to fill the water to the top and put a cover on it. You put a cover on it to just control how fast the water goes out. If you want it to go out very fast, remove the top. If you want it to drip out slowly, just put the cover. So you're going to fill the bottle to the top, and this is the level of the first hole to keep the surface moist. So as the water keeps on dripping out, it goes to the lower parts, as the, so which means all the root regions from the top here to the bottom, they will all get water. And so I have a, I'll have a bottle here, I'll have another one here and here. So the plant will be well watered. Okay, I watered these uh, plants in the morning. Look at how the sun is hot. See? And I showed you, if you don't take a lot of time and water it for long to wait for the water to seep down, you will only be watering the surface. So like this, you'll ensure even the, all the root regions get water. So all the bottles are in. So let me fill the bottles with water and return back the soil. Oh, I've got some water here. Let's fill this bottle very fast. See. When I put the cover, the water stream out slowly. When I remove the cover, 
the water gets out see so don't take too many holes because you want to keep the soil moist See how the water is streaming out. You see? So you are sure that if you fill this bottle and all the holes are watered like this, your plants have sufficient water even for three days. So we are solving a number of problems because water is going to be evaporating but now the water is deep inside so we are solving the problem of evaporation of water so fast before the plant has taken it in because we just watered the surface and also you are solving the problem of time if you don't have time every day to come to the garden use this method I filled it up See? So the water is seeping out and it's going to go to this side, to this side, this side, this side, like that.